we're a food pantry, but we kind of see ourselves as having a, a unique model of how we serve the community. We deliver food to people's homes. My man Mario is yeah, one of these, yeah, what yeah. we call community <laughs> partners. He comes every week faithfully and takes food. We know in the end we're really serving somebody um, and helping somebody, you know, do better in life and thrive. And that's what we're working on today to get closer to God, to know we're not only packing bags, but we're actually doing this to help serve a community that needs us so desperately. Hello, my name is Chip Hanna. I'm the Executive Director of Servants Heart Ministry. Our goal is not only to be, but to empower. To truly empower a family, it takes more than just meeting a basic needs. It takes time, it takes resources. So as a, a service uh, nonprofit, we have to be willing to give up ourselves to the people we're serving. Volunteers are the heart and soul of Servants Heart Ministry. Um, without their help, none of the work gets done. I mean, we had the privilege of meeting Mario Perez probably about a year ago. Um, he came to Servants Heart Ministry from Nona Church. He's been a blessing. He comes here with the heart of Jesus. He has a desire to serve and show the light of Christ to the community. So it's an honor to have him. We sometimes get so distracted and we forget that there's a neighborhood who is suffering, who is in need, who needs us to be the hands and body of Christ to go where they are. God has also placed amazing organizations that are there in the community for us to partner and be part of what, of what their hearts and missions are. Doing service is showing also the love for people and showing others that we love and care for them. I think it's like speak more than like thousand words, like you can do something for someone, they are going to receive it as a big expression of love. No matter what age, gender, experience you have in like serving, that you can go out and do it. God has placed us in this community, in this moment in time, to be agents of change and transformation with the gospel. And this is this is the church embodying the gospel. Yeah, sometimes it's it's like you guys come here to serve and we do a little ministering, but you guys end up ministering. So we need each other. Okay, thank you.